Hey, you guys, I know I look a little, I am about to do something I don't think I've ever done on my channel. I really want to cut my locks so bad. But before I do, there's just one thing that I've always wanted to do to my locks and that's color them. So I'm going to show you what products I'm using. We'll do a length check. You make sure you follow me on Instagram at nadiaandnice.hair. All right. Here are my locks. They are about butt length. Um, and let's get started. Now you all, I really didn't know how many boxes of color I wanted to use since my hair is so long, but the lady told me to at least get six boxes. So that's what I got. Initially I had four. So I had two copper and two sizzling copper and I went back today to get two more sizzling copper because they didn't have any more copper. I wish I had all of one, but we'll see how it works out. I also have some gloves. I have some dirty volume developer. I have my bowls to mix in and I brought, I bought some Adore just in case it was like too bright and I didn't like it. So I brought some Adore to tone it down in the end. We'll see how it goes. I don't really plan on using the Adore, but we'll see how it goes. So I guess for um, every 2.5 ounces of this developer, you will use one whole box of this. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna follow the measurements perfectly. Yeah, I am super nervous because I just have to put it on fast. So I'm just worried about it not, me not being able to put it on that fast because my hair is so long, but. Let's get it to win. I'm gonna put five ounces and then just two. Ooh, it's coming out fast, y'all. Here we go. I am gonna do sizzling copper. And copper. Y'all, hope this works. The copper one is already mixed. See how it's coming out orange? The sizzling copper is white with like the um, colored color drops you have to add in. So this is what it looks like. I mixed two different colors. We're about to see what it do, y'all. You guys have no idea what I just been through. As you can tell. It went down. My bathroom was a complete mess trying to apply this color. I was about ready to cut it. If it doesn't turn out right, I'm telling you now. I'm cutting my hair. But as of right now, I'm about to take this down so I can show y'all. This is what we're looking like. I'm about to wash them out. Let's give them a little mermaid. <laughs> but hold on. I'm going to wash it out and come back. Hi, you guys. So I am back. I didn't change my shirt because it was just a mess. I to throw some eyebrows, some lashes on. I used six boxes total to color my hair. I used sizzling copper and regular copper with developer. So one of each is two boxes with the developer in the back half of my hair. Same combination on the top half of my hair. Then I just had two sizzling coppers left over and um, I let my hair sit with a plastic bag on top for about 25, close to 30 minutes. I'm not really sure. It took so long for me to apply that product on my hair thoroughly. So I'm hoping that all in all it is fully saturated, fully, you know, I don't have any dark um, areas in my hair, but I just wanted to do it because, I, like I said, I'm planning on cutting my locks. I've been saying that for like the past two years. We'll see. So I applied the um, color to my roots and then I let it sit. Now I let it sit longer than 10 minutes. It was probably another 20 minutes. Don't be a me. You know, I got busy, I got kids, I got little kids, so it's just hard, but got it done, washed it out um, thoroughly. Like you wanna wash, you wanna rinse the product out as much as you can, well, shampoo as many times as you need to so that water is like running clear. And then I um, use my Design Essentials, I wanna say it was the avocado, I forgot the name of it, but it was the Desi Design Essentials um, moisturizing conditioner. And I love it. it, smells amazing. And it's so thick and creamy and I love using that type of conditioner on color. So let's get into this big reveal. 
Hey guys, let's see. Oh, it's cute. It's bright in person. Wow. Now in person, it is like, it's kind of what I was going for in person, but not showing that on camera. So let's go outside. I have these little baby locks that I have like four of them. I got one right here. So just don't mind that, but let's go outside and see. Mm. Oh yeah, outside. I feel like you can see it better. Yeah, yeah, I love it. Yes, I love it. Oh my god, it's really giving. Oh my god, it's gorgeous. Yeah. You can see how it looks outside. I really love it. I love how like my ends that were already light took. It's so cute. So I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna do some curls and um, just leave them in as long as I can. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for the next video part two of me styling my locks.